Hello healers! Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today is another fun pick a card video and this is all about why did you meet this person. So if you want to know why this person came across your path or if you still have them in your life or if you don't, doesn't matter. It's just about thinking one, about one specific person and, and understanding why did you meet them. You know, and whether it's a loved one or a friendship, you you know we, who do you want to ask about. And uh, don't worry, just concentrate on the pile. This is going to be group number one, two, and three. If you want to concentrate on the cards or on the pyramid crystals, just think about one specific person and ask, why did you meet this person? Okay, and we're going to try to answer that with the cards today. And hopefully will be able to resonate with you and help you out in some way. Just remember it's general and I do private readings as well if you want more details, more specific to your situation. I'm always happy to hear from you. Okay, again, thanks very much for leaving messages, subscribing. If you're not yet subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. I'm leaving messages, message of the day videos every day here for you and every second day I have a longer video with this kind of questions or something that we can be guided through the cards, tarot cards or oracle cards. I'm always combining them to help us out in some way, having some guidance in our lives. So I'm always happy to hear from you. Leave me a comment. If you resonated, again, concentrate card or crystal group number one, two and three. Timestamp will be below. Okay, thanks very much for watching. Group number one, if you chose this beautiful red pyramid crystal, we leave it here to help us out. Why did you meet this person? You know who you're thinking about already and your cards here are the moon. We have the ace of cups. We have the three of wands. And we have the six of wands. We also have the angels at the cloud. My message here is security. We have the love message in with the angel sun of one. And we have the warrior. Be fearless and stand strong. Alright, group number one is straight away. Why did you meet this person? This person came into your life to show you like a new a new way of thinking like um, so any way of showing emotions for you and uh, a different path as well in your life a different time in your life maybe you need it at the time but uh, you're waiting for something different and this person came along the way bringing something different into your life and the six of ones here showing celebrations uh, like really showing that uh, like I say, maybe you met through friends and uh, through a gathering because of the celebration as well. But it really brought you to a different point way. Maybe you had to to go through some, or you. I feel like you came from a difficult path before meeting this person, and they came to your life to bring a new a new phase into your life. You learning through this experience, or you did learn if this person is not in your life anymore. But this person brought uh, came to your life to bring security and love. Whether maybe you understand or not, maybe something you will understand at some point. Because security here, I feel for some of you, in the way you think about yourself, and um, you know, like security, like being secure with yourself, with who you are, and be tr being true to yourself. And love this person definitely um, love you even if this person is not in your life anymore this person love you right there's no love here it's love and um, the warrior here be fearless and stand strong I feel like after this person came into your life you learn how to be more strong more independent more true to yourself that's why I'm saying it was a new phase I don't feel like this is how you were in the beginning before you met this person, whether it's a friend or or an, if it's a love relationship. Whether you are with them or not, it's really about 
being able to feel strong about yourself and uh, learn through the past. So this person came into your life to bring you security about who you are, even if it, for some of you may not have been in the e the easiest thing. But I feel like for many of you, this is this was a, a nice change from who you were before meeting them, from the situation that you were. And th there was a new change. So maybe you traveled together or maybe you 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 had some chances to like go to a completely different path from what you were before. They really show you a different way of expressing yourself as well with the, your emotions, with this Ace of Cups here. Like really being able to, for some of you, be able to tell the person that you love them that maybe you have not been able to say before to other people or you love them but you just didn't express so definitely a new way of expressing. This person came to your life to help you to learn how to express yourself. Like I said, a new path. And it was, I don't know if this person is still in your life or not, but I feel it is for many of you because it's, it's some happy time, some celebration here. And security and love really strong here and like showing you standing up for yourself and being strong. It, this person came into your life like I say, whether they are still here or not, it was really true for you to become a stronger person, a more secure into yourself, learn to love yourself as well, and uh, being able to express yourself more freely with your thoughts, with your emotions, being able to not feel, you know, that you needed to hide everything. Maybe I feel like for some of you, you were a bit of secretive person before this this person came into your life like really a bit closed and uh, people didn't didn't know how to read you didn't understand you very much but you you're able to be a much more free person right now uh, with the way you express yourself because you have learned some things with this person they, you know whether like I say they are with you or not I feel like they are with many of you because of the security and the love as well like I say, no matter where they are at the moment, they do love you. They help you to become more a more secure person and strong and stand up for yourself. So maybe you look back and that's how you, you will understand yourself now. Looking back from when you met this person, looking back how you are now, I believe you are a more secure person. You can express yourself. You love yourself more and you really can stand up for yourself. You are more... Uh, you fearless person like this card here you're more like a warrior fearless and standing strong really beautiful card here i feel like this here represent you right now the way you are at the moment after all the time is spent with this person like i say whether they are with you or not you're definitely a more strong and fearless person right now so you are this warrior right now because of this person so look back of what you have learned with them of what you have at the moment because of them so i feel like this is who you are not just because of this person it's just the way they this person did help you to become this this warrior that you are at the moment all right so i feel like you're a beautiful person now and not that we, we you're never perfect we're always learning and changing uh, of course but i feel like you're really strong on yourself. Of, uh, you really can stand up for yourself right now, which is really beautiful, and you can express yourself much more. So this person came into your life to give you some new perspectives and did help you out throughout this process. Not it's not all a because of this person that you are this warrior now, but it did. This person did help you out. If you look back, you may understand right now. Okay. So group number one. I hope it resonated in some way. If it did, let me know. Like I always say, I'm going to be really happy to hear from you. Okay, leave me a comment, let me know. But this is what I feel for you. That's why you met this person, group number one. Thanks very much for watching. Group number two, if you chose this beautiful pyramid crystal, we leave it here to help us out. You know who you're thinking about now. Why did you meet this person? So we have the page of cups. We have the ace of wands. We have the Tree of Pentacles. We also have the Four of Pentacles. And we have 
Courage. We also have uh, Animal Guardian, Trust Your Instincts, and Be Brave and Honest. Alright, group number two. Straight away I feel like this person came to you, like straightforward, quite blunt, showing you all their emotions and um, showing you how they feel about you and being really happy um, to to be to to express themselves to be very forward with their words with their emotions and uh, showing you passion the way to like I say express very very direct and this person did come to you as well showing you a way at a time where you could uh, work together understanding how you could uh, work together towards a goal and um, you know it could be real work for some of you like um, working together like a job something specific that you did together project or to achieve some goal and uh, really being able to hold on to yourself and uh, holding on to what you achieved but it did show you as well that uh, a bit of jealousy to some of you uh, it show you that you're holding on too much to the person or the situation that you were at the time but in any case like if they is still in your life or not it's a person that uh, show you how to be and have more courage and uh, trust your instincts and uh, to be brave and honest so this person sh helped you that's why you met this person because maybe that's how they were they were really courageous in their words and and the way they expressed themselves they were straightforward not afraid to hold on to what they wanted and show and even sometimes be a little bit negative as well that way but just uh, like I said they, they didn't always express themselves in the best way it could be a little bit immature sometimes but in any case they show you that there is a way to to express yourself without fear and uh, you know trust your instincts as well they help you learn how to trust yourself and be more honest with yourself like you maybe admire the way they did and it's not something you were doing before like being very straightforward with people and showing you what they wanted and uh, you did learn with that and uh, you became a, a more courageous person not just because of this person but they did help you with your path right so it's not that we are not becoming a better person because of only one person in our lives but definitely because of uh, many different situations we go through so this person did you meet this person to have more courage and uh, be more honest and uh, trust your instincts and brave and honesty again here you know, so co courage, trust your instincts, be brave and honest. That's how you would have become because of this person. So you met them so you could become this more strong, courageous person. Maybe you don't or didn't realize at the time or maybe you, you, you just right now with these words you can look back and think like, yes, you are a more courageous person be because of this person that came through your life. I feel for some of you they are not is still there but it, they will it will be for for many of you this is someone that's still in your life but it could be someone that you grew up together as well because um, because it's a page of cups it's like a, a young person as well so this is someone who could be in your life for a while or someone that you met uh, when you were younger and uh, or like I said, like maybe you, ha you know them for a while. But in any case, they were always very straightforward. And that is something you learn. And then this person came into your life, like I say, whether they are still here or not in your life. For some of you, definitely they're still in your life. It could be like best friends and all that. Or it could be like um, someone that you have a relationship with. But you're definitely a more brave person, an honest person. Because you have seen the example of this person in your life and you have been happy to follow on the foot on the footpath and say like you you probably saw 
like I say, like the the work that was done together, and you saw the results, and you saw, and you understood, like because you were honest, or this person was honest and straightforward, this work did work, you know, in like I say, the project or something you did together, or even like a relationship you built together, it worked because the person built the foundation of being. Uh, direct, cora- um, courageous, and honest the whole time. And uh, like I say, for some of you, th- this person is even a bit jealous of you. Like uh, they, because they love you they so much, they are a bit jealous of you. And this could have been the case for some of you to not have this person anymore in your life. But for many of you, you did work through, if this was a relationship as well, you did work through, this phase and you enter into a more mature time of the life you definitely this person definitely came into your life to give you some examples of things that you wanted to have into your life and you did adapt into your life so if you look back you will understand now that you you have more courage you are more you trust more your instincts and you are more brave and honest with yourself and others not only because of this person, like I say, it's not just because of one person, but because of this relationship being in your life at some point, or maybe still now, if he, if this is the person that's still in your life. In, you definitely are a more brave and honest person. So you should really be happy with yourself now, uh, with the way you, you are, you are becoming, because you're always evolving. Of course, you're always learning every day. But if you look back, this person did help a help into your life on how you are right now, how you are more courageous, how you can trust your instincts, and how you are more brave and honest with yourself. It's just the way they were from the beginning, very direct, like I say, even immature at some times, but that did definitely have some influence on you that helped you out. So that's why you met this person, to learn uh, this this way of communicating and uh, trusting yourself as well, your instincts. But let, like I say, whether they are still in your life or not, there was a lesson to learn with this person. Like I say, not only them, but they did help you out in this area of your life, especially trusting your instincts and being brave and honest with yourself and others. Okay, so if it did resonate with you, let me know group number two. That's what I see for this person, whether they still or not in your life. Maybe it's something that you look back and you understand now. Maybe it's not something you did understand at the time. But when you look back now, you do understand. Yes, you're definitely more courageous now. Definitely you you trust more of your instincts and you're more brave and honest because you this person did help you out in that way as well. Okay, so let me know if it did resonate, group number two. It may not be for all of you, but it's for some of you for sure. All right, I feel here. And if it did, let me know. Uh, if it doesn't and you want to contact me for your specific question, I'm going to be really happy to hear from you. You can always contact me. I do private readings. Okay, this is, like I say, it's general. But I hope it resonated in some way and helped you out. And if it did, let me know. I'm going to be really happy to hear from you. Okay, thanks very much, group number two. Group number three, if you chose this beautiful lilac purple pyramid, you live here to help us out and you know the person you're thinking about why did you meet this person we have here the cards ten of wands we have the star we also have the sun we have the king of wands we have the earth force also Wise one, grow within your current situation. And the sun again, interesting. Enjoy success and happiness. Nice. Like I say, I always pray upon the cards. I don't choose them. So we have the sun here and here. Very interesting. Right. Why did you meet this person? Okay. Straight away here, number group number three. This person did then did come into your life to help you out in some way maybe you are carrying too much uh, at the time to your plate and uh, you know having like a, a harder time 
you know, dealing with a situation specifically or maybe different situations. And this person did come into your life here to, to help you out with a burden, whether it was relationship, work, you know a situation that you had at the time. This person did appear and then helped you out. And then also helping you out here, like guiding you, giving you some directions on, on your life path and uh, bringing you into a much happier times with the sun here, like success and happiness and having a more strong, um, really way, like it, you became like a, a more strong person as well because of this relationship, right? Because they were strong. I say, I say they were like this king of wands, decided regarding the passions, the work, what they wanted to do in life. Because this person, I feel it was like this strong person that could help you with the burdens and things, was able to guide you with the light, like, uh, like a star guiding you and also bringing you into the sun with uh, more and happy times. So it was definitely like a, this, this earth forces here. Like it was, it's really something regarding to the soulmate uh, relationships in a way that it doesn't need to be um, like a loving relationship. It doesn't need to be like a love relationship. It could be friendship as well. But uh, it, it's, still, it's still soulmate like in a way that your souls were around the same area before coming to earth so i feel like this could be someone that was your soulmate like in a way that you knew them already they came to like help you out and give you some guide and and i i feel like they came into a really hard time into your life like you were really um a bit hard uh, time in a way that you could not uh, had loads of you feel like you had so much burdens and you couldn't carry anymore like this time of once here they came in to help you out just give you that that small push that you needed to carry on and uh, be able to see another path another way into your life and be able to complete your task complete that work that you needed like they help you out to achieve something specifically like i say like a light like a star guiding you and uh, like uh, the sun bringing you into a more positive and happy times so like i say the earth force like in a way that they had to be is something like it was meant to happen like even like i say like like a soulmate like something that they you knew th them before and the wise one grow within your current situation it's like i really feel like you did grow from a harder situation, from a situation that you were at the time, whether, like I say, it's a relationship, love relationship, or friendship, they help you out in a hard time, in a hard time, and you became a wiser person, and uh, they did help you in, with one specific situation, and then when you look back, they did bring you to a much happier times when you had more success and happiness. So, because they were strong as well, I feel like this this here is more the way you were, and then the way they guided you because this is how they were, and how you became with the more stronger person, and you became this wise one, in in enjoy more success and happy times into your life because this person was there, or is there is still because some of, for some of you this person is still there, for some of you it's not there anymore. It's just someone who had passed into your life but if you look back they did bring you happiness they did guide you in some way through a harder situation that you were able to move forward and pass through to a much happier time so you met this person why did you meet this person to become this wiser person and to enjoy more success and happiness into your life and maybe for some of you you you're not there yet because you this person just is not in your life anymore but if you look back, how much wiser and happy and success you have now, looking back, like I, I said on the other ones, it's not because of one person alone, it's because of many different situations you go through and the people that pass through our life. So this person as well pass through your life to help you and guide you in a harder time to become a more stronger person, a wiser one, 
and enjoy more success and happiness into your life. So you may be still getting into the success and happiness into your life, some of you, but believe me, it's there for you because you're already a wiser person. Definitely, if you look back, you this, this person did influence you into becoming a wiser person. They had some way of of guiding you and um, because they, I feel like they already knew some of the things that you didn't know at the time and um, they, they, they helped you whether you're happy or not with this. I feel for some of you, you may not be completely happy with this person. They may not still be in your life, but you look back and you understand why this happened because you grow within the, the situation. So you did grow with the situation whether they are still in your life or not. So they helped you grow. They helped you, like I say, see and become a more wiser person and enjoy more success and happiness into your life. So it, it may be specific for some of you. Like I said, for some of you, you have this person. For some of you, you don't have any more. But just look back on how you were here when they just you just met them and how you are now. So... Like I say, whether they're here or not, you should be able to enjoy more success and happiness. Not only because of this person, but also because they pass through your life and uh, whether they're still here or not. All right. So I hope it will resonate with some of you. I maybe it's a bit specific. Like I say, this, this, is, this is quite general. But if you want something very, very specific to your life, do contact me. I get a few different messages for some of you and uh, hopefully resonated with many if it did let me know i'm gonna be really happy to hear from you but group number three look back and see how you are enjoying success and happiness right now or you will be enjoying success and happiness when you look back and uh, thinking about this person how you were when you met them and how you are right now okay so just let me know if it resonated leave me a comment i'm gonna be really happy to hear from you definitely like I said, it, I feel like it will resonate with some of you. It may not with some others, but if you have something very specific you want to ask me, do send me a message. I'm going to be happy to answer back. Okay? So, again, thanks very much for being here with me, group number three. If it resonated, let me know. Thanks for watching.